All right, welcome back. All right, so got um, had to go get a little hammer and a punch because I had these painted. They it was wouldn't come out, so had to kind of tap it out. But now that it's been tapped out, seems to go in and out just fine. So that's just a steel pin to take this uh, strut off here, and you have to disconnect the actual strut or uh, not strut, but the actual air cylinder here. There we go. And I'm gonna replace this plastic ball in with a metal one. I've had that actually break on me. So, so here's the old system. goes either way um, so if, if 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 this air cylinder fails then this could the gear could collapse this way it can collapse this way and then when it slams down it folds up like this kind of rotates around and then as it comes down it does comes out and then bam so all that pressure will break this or pull this apart so the new one like I've already shown you guys a few times has a stop in it so, and, ooh, that's dirty. Let me find something to, to wipe that off with. I found out what the, it did with my GoPro camera was yesterday. So, the shutting down after I replaced the card is, was an overheating thing. And I'm like, are you kidding me? Why, how does a GoPro overheat? Well, apparently, it's not an uncommon thing. Um, if you're, if you turn your settings up way higher than needed to be, and you're running for a long period of time, uh, you have to, um, you have to worry about heat. And I was doing like a 12-minute video, and it, and it finally shut down just because of the heat, and I felt it. But after watching some YouTube stuff on the on the GoPro Hero 12. Um, there's just a few settings that you just don't need on for what I'm doing. Uh, it's not that it affects the quality, it just affects, um, you know, I'm using higher settings than I really need. Uh, frame rates that actually aren't as appealing to the human eye, things like that, that you just don't need on will really make this thing get hot. Uh, and shut down. So if you turn off a couple things and you keep it, you know, 4K resolution and um, some things that you really don't need unless you're doing like slow motion or still and very short things, uh, you can turn this thing all the way up and just get the best it'll give you, but it's going to get hot fast, so you have to do smaller videos. And it's just hard to do that, you know, like I said, because it's just me here being solo. Um, but so I turned down a couple things. It, it still gets warm, but nothing like it was. So I should be able to get my video. Ooh, that's tight. Hmm. Well, that's a problem right there. That tolerances. And I know that some of that's probably from paint. So let me push it on here. We may not, I may not be able to use this. Just because of the, let's just put a pin in and just see. So the cool thing about these pins is he's got one side of them versus two needing two clips. You just have one side. So I'm gonna put the, the clip side on the inside here. That was a hell of a, and, and just kind of work it a little bit. It's loosening it up, there we go. It's probably a paint. Yeah, it's paint. So yeah, let me pop this guy back out. Yeah, so I need to essentially clean off the paint off this guy. There we go. Yeah, let me get some get some light sandpaper here. And I know I'm zipping around, probably making you guys dizzy, but that's the trade-off. Where 
Where is my little hand sander? I was gonna clean up today. That was the first thing I was gonna do. I made like this crazy list this morning of stuff that I wanted to do. Um, but I am just struggling with lazies today. I had a long night. Had a little bit of to drink, stuff like that. I had a good night, so it was a little hard getting up. So I got some things done. <sighs> Man, but I really, I think I'm gonna, after this, when I go in and go eat, when I come back out, I am going to, going to, um, take a tactical pause and do some cleaning. <laughs> so, but I'm starting to get a, starting to get a bunch of questions, you know, comments and things like that, which I like. That's what this is all about. Um, I'm still trying to get some answers. I would love to, to to talk to somebody that has one of these now with the newer linear actuators on them to see. From what I understand, I think they're still metal. Um, but I would like to see what what um, ratio they're using and if, it, if they've had any issues with it. So. Yeah, that's, I think it's just gonna have to work. Work itself. Yeah, that's already better. Oop, where'd it go? Yeah, there we go. So that's looking good. All right, so got to get my, go get a pair of, I like to use these guys. These are my uh, ball in ball pliers for helis, but it, it's got like these little grooves cut in them that's perfect to hold, hold a, a rod or something while you do this and it doesn't scratch it. So, that is, you don't want to scratch, scratch this and put any kind of marking on it because uh, there we go. And I need to get some Loctite. <sighs> but yeah, comments, keep commenting guys. Let me know what you think. If you want to see something in particular, let me know, things like that. And man, it's just hard to, to see what I'm making sure I'm looking at the right thing for you guys and you guys are seeing it. But um, yeah, if you want to see something specific, let me... Well, that went my door just opening. Hold on a second, guys. I didn't have it closed all the way. And I'm no pro, so if you want pro quality, this ain't the channel for you. <laughs> but I'll get there. Um, I'll get there. Ah, uh, see, I did put a booger on it. Dang it. Uh, how did that, uh, see it's sticking, I can feel a little burr, I don't know how I got a burr on there, that's alright, that's alright, where's that little piece of, yeah, let me take this back. Well, that sucks. Well, I do have another air cylinder for this. Lesson learned. Don't, uh, don't, uh, grab these with any pliers. Actually, it might help if I put the sandpaper side on it. <laughs> Where is that burr? Ah, got it. Awesome. There we go. Good. 
clean those off a little better. All right. Probably should put a little, a little nut on this. Yeah, you know what? Let's see if I got one this small. Yeah, well, hey, I'm gonna stop this video and uh, I'll do another one. Cause I keep having to get up, and get up and get down too much and it's just slowing the video down. I don't wanna keep boring you guys, but yeah, so gonna put a little nut on the back side of this you kind of need something because if not if you don't they'll get it'll start developing slop and then you know it could essentially unscrew itself so even with a loctite probably won't but I'm gonna do it right plastic it's not a big deal it has a you know a tighter fit but these machine ones you kind of need a, a little nut on the back side so I got to go find uh, find one <laughs> so I'm gonna end this now and I'll do I'll pick it back up once I got, got it together and show you guys kind of uh, what it looks like. So take it easy and uh, talk to you guys later.